And it's Ken Kreitzer for the New York St. Patrick's Day Parade. I have a chance to talk to Tommy Smith of ESPN, a former Grand Marshal this parade. And Tommy, I don't think you ever stop being Grand Marshal. No, I don't think you do. I mean, I certainly... Uh well, I don't wear the sash to bed anymore. I mean, I just did that the first year when I was Grand Marshal. But you never lose it. I mean, you're never an ex-Grand Marshal. You know, you're always a Grand Marshal. I mean, every time there's a president goes out, he's still Mr. President. So I'm still Mr. Grand Marshal as far as I'm concerned. What was the best uh, time about being Grand Marshal? I mean, you seem to enjoy it as much as anyone I've ever seen. Well, I think just the fact that, you know, I, I grew up in a very small village in, in County Loud. And I ended up coming to the United States and I never in my wildest, wildest dreams ever imagined that I would be Grand Marshal of the biggest parade in the world, that I was going to lead the Irish up Fifth Avenue. I mean, this was just unheard of. And to think that I actually got the opportunity to do it, it's a day in my life that I, I, I wish I could, I li could live over a dozen times. There was only one bad part of the day, and I explained that to Tressa. The bad part of the day was when I came to 83rd Street, I said, oh my God, there's about three blocks left, and then I'm not Grand Marshal anymore, but I'm still Mr. Grand Marshal. That's great. No, we have a, a wonderful Grand Marshal this year, Jack Ahern, uh, received many accolades at the uh, brunch today. Any thoughts for our Grand Marshal this year on how to enjoy the experience? Oh, Jack, just get out there. I mean, they're going to love you. They're going to love you. You're going to love them from Mass. If you can get to any of the events beforehand, get to them and just go out. And as you go up Fifth Avenue, you're king of Fifth Avenue that day. And look at every moment of it. Every moment of it is so important. And every moment of it has a memory in it. You'll never forget it, Jack. And I wish you the very best of luck. And most importantly... I wish you a good, good weather day. I hope it's a really nice day for you. And Tommy Smith, you'll again be part of the broadcast team for the parade, something I know you enjoy very much. What's it, what is it like to be broadcasting worldwide now on the, from New York on the St. Patrick's Day Parade? Well, it's more responsibility. Uh, Trasta does most of the uh, research for me. She makes me look good. But now you realize that, you know, there are more eyes, there are more ears. You better not make mistakes because I'll tell you one thing. There's one thing about the Irish, they're not afraid to tell you when you made a mistake, so you better not make any mistakes, and we're really looking forward to St. Patrick's Day. Tommy, anything coming up on ESPN you're doing? Well, we got a lot of the World Cup coming up in the summer, so that'll be the big one, you know, and, uh, you know, Ireland got a pretty difficult draw in the Euros, but, hey, they may get out of that group, but the World Cup is the big one. Tommy Smith, always a pleasure. You're such a great Grand Marshal and representative of the New York St. Patrick's Day Parade. Thank you very much, and uh, good luck. And uh, I know this is a new venture, and I know it will go well, believe me. Tommy Smith, thank you so much, and we'll look forward to seeing you on Fifth Avenue on March 17th. This is Ken Kreitzer for the New York St. Patrick's Day Parade.